Welcome, welcome this morning. You're with Dr. Harris, Dr. Harris, senior pastor here at Free AME Ministries here, right here on the Golden West Side of Fresno, California. You know I've renamed our city to <laughs> Mississippi, Fresno, Cal, Alabama, because of the uh, 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 different things that black folks are going through, people are going through, the political system that's, go that's happening to machine that's gobbling up our people like Miss Pac-Man. Oh, and uh, but you know Miss Pac-Man and Miss Pac-Man they used to hit that big old big old round circle and they could go and chase the other one. So mm -hmm. you know that's kind of the concept of where we at this morning and, and we have our very own this morning. Uh, my elder, my brother, my teacher here with us this morning, uh, Dr. Kayende. Uh, he's my doctor uh, mm -hmm. because uh, when things go on in our community uh, we go to him, we seek knowledge, we seek understanding, uh, and we just thank him for being with us here again every fourth, 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 <laughs> fourth, fourth Sunday. Uh, uh, he comes here and he speaks from the roster, and we welcome here, him here uh, mm -hmm. all the time. And my folks here know to make sure we take care of him uh, uh, here on our premises, we give them first class treatment as we do everyone. You do, you but, do. but as our elder, we make sure that we look after and then our, our young people, yes. uh, our youth that's yes. two and three, four foot tall, yes. get an opportunity to see him in person, you know, yes. to touch him, to hug him, mm -hmm. uh, to be able to speak to him. Um, because we're planting seeds in right. our That's children right. right now, right? right. Is that right? That's we're right. planting seeds in our children, right? Because our children is our replacement. Right? That's right. Absolutely. And and one of the things, Ella, before we go into the sure. interview, is that I was speaking to Aline this morning, and it just hit my spirit real yes, hard. Yes, sir. That I feel here in Fresno that there's no respect for black people. I yeah. feel that. I'm looking at how jobs are being given out to different mm -hmm. other ethnic people, mm -hmm. uh, and our folk ain't getting anything. Mm -hmm. uh, and and what I and what I and I'm not saying this because I've experienced it myself. Mm -hmm. And you know when I look at the interview panels, it's all white and it's all Hispanic. Right. Exactly. So who are they going to be loyal to? The Hispanic and the white. That's right. There are no really. I interviewed from jobs all the way down to Stockton. And then they'll get the job. Never get the job. And so, and I know my credentials. So, but what I worry about is someone, a younger person that do not have the credentials that I have. Yes, yes, sir. What, what, where did that put them, you know? Mm -hmm. And so I, I just not going to say that we have all lazy black people. Because we don't come no, from no, no, we don't no, come no. from lazy. No, people. no, we built the country. <laughs> How we lazy? We didn't build the United States. You know that. So the lazy people what brought right, us over here. Right, right. So <laughs> you know, I I'm getting ready to address these issues here. Uh, mm -hmm. We're getting ready to launch our this Thursday. Me, myself, Aline, and we're going to be inviting people to come to be on our show. It's going to be called the Black Agenda. Yeah. I want to be very clear. I want to be very precise. No misunderstanding mm -hmm. and unapologetic about yes, our approach about the black agenda. And we're going to be doing a report card, a report card on how we're being treated, right. report Good. card on how we're getting left out of jobs, report card on the political system that has no respect for us here That's right. in this county. And so, you know, as we look at the makeup of city council here, there's no black folk on there. Oh, we look at the makeup of, of the Board of Supervisors, no black folk there. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, but even if we get someone there, we have to hold them accountable That's right. to us, right? Because That's right it. now, the way I see it, the landscape right now that's here in Fresno County, they're not even thinking about us. Not even, not, but, even, not even in discussion. Not even in discussion. Don't even want us at the table. That's right. And so we're going to change that narrative now. We, we, I want you to understand that we may be small, but we're mighty. We're small, yes. but we're mighty. And so nevertheless, we want to bring our, uh, I'm not even going to call him our guest. He's our <laughs> elder here and our teacher, uh, Dr. Kayende. And welcome back to to your 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 college, <laughs> your institution here. Huh? Did I say that right? This is his institution, his college. huh? That's right. I, I said it. <laughs> His institution, his, just like when he worked at City College, that was his classroom, 
Now, this is his classroom All right, right here on Fourth Sundays. Any Sunday, as a matter of fact, any day of the week that's is right. his university. And that's Thank what you. he teaches us is that Thank this you. has to be a university of liberation for black people and all people at that. So welcome. Talk, talk to us this well, morning. First of all, let me give. It's a great honor always. Yes, sir. To, for you <laughs> to be here with you. <laughs> yes. You my man. <laughs> This is my main guy here. <laughs> this is my main man. Yes, sir. He's, yes, he's, he's my hero. So yes, I'm sir. saying this from my heart. And I want to say, uh, uh, Pastor Dr. Harris, you are, you are our Malcolm X, Nat Turner. Yes, sir. <laughs> In the Fresno area. <laughs> That's what you are. Yes, sir. And I have so much love and respect for you, brother. Yes, and I'm always honored to be here with you and with the community anytime I can. The community is my heart, yes, you know. And so uh, I am in, a, in, in this historical moment. I'm very, very uh, pleased I can speak and connect with our community. This is a very important uh, time in our history. And if stuff like you were just talking about, we're going to deal with that. Yes, sir. We, we ain't no more second class. Not, you know, I said uh, before, uh, our, our sister Kamala said, not one step back. Yes, sir. I said that six or seven months ago, yes, not sir. one step back, because I, I knew there would be some kind of effort to put black folks back into 1820. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I knew yes, that's sir. where they want, they want to go there. I'm right. serious. Right. And so, um, uh, not one step back. We ain't going back to that more. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be respected. Right, right, right. Yeah, we're going to be respected. Right. That, that, that's going to be. Right. No more Jim Crow. No more Jim Crow. That's gone. Right. That's right. I, I, I'm real serious. I know, no, no, we all have to be serious right. about that. Right. So I'm very honored to be here with you, brother. Yes, and sir. Uh, what you do is just magnificent. My man, this is. You know, Doc, I, I, one of my colleagues came by today, and I was explaining to him, you know, we have a fitness center here. Yeah. Most institutions like this don't have fitness and all they want to talk is religion. You know, all that. I don't sell religion, you know. Yeah, I know you I, don't. I, I'm about the mind and liberation of our people. But one of the things, Doctor, that we have to understand is that we got to start eating right. We got to start that. You're 100% right. You know, we are what we eat. You know, if you want to eat potato chips right. all day, that's what you're going to do. Yeah, you're 100% you know? right. And so we, we put a, a fitness center here, right, so that we can yes. be able to work with yes. our congregation the community for those who take their health serious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, we, we have our TV studio here, as well as our radio studio. Mm -hmm. We also have our community guard with Fresno Freedom School mm -hmm. who teach kids how to, that's, and you always told me that, that yes. that's revolutionary. But that's revolutionary. And and I was going to ask you, are you still juicing? <laughs> still juicing. <laughs> still me juicing. Too. Seven days a week. <laughs> me too, my man. <laughs> me too. I, I, I have to say I'm doing the same thing. Yes, sir. And yes, then sir. we're also starting, doctor, uh, also uh, an educational center here where we are mm -hmm. uh, putting up a job board where folks can come. When we do our food giveaway on Thursdays, folks come get food, we give our clothes, we mm -hmm. give our socks, shoes. Beautiful. We have a job board. I want to connect with Workforce Connection. And, and mm -hmm. connects anyone that's dealing with employment. I want to make sure our people have first get jobs in it. Absolutely. You know, because and get hired. Right, get hired. And then we're going to they, they can enter, they can have an interview. I've right. seen it at City College. Right. You have even black people on the panel. But but the, when they come together right. and make the final decision, right. they, the, the, the black person never gets in that. Right. They never get in the pool. Right. That's what right. they call it. And that's what we're dealing with today. And that's what I'm acknowledging and seeing in my spirit. Mm -hmm. And we're going to address it. You know, we have to. Yeah, there's no running from anything. That's right. I mean, we ran. I, I, we ran our ancestors long enough. Now we we're sure the did. children of the ancestors. That's right. We ain't running no more. That's right. So we're gonna deal with you. Mm -hmm. We're gonna hopefully talk. See, see, here's one of the things that I learned about Dr. King. Dr. King said when he dealt with issues, he dealt with three things. He said the first one was he said when there's an issue, you try to uh, talk about it. Mm -hmm. You know, then you negotiate. That's right. And if negotiate don't work, then you go into direct action. So those That's are the right. three principles That's that right. I have that in our community. So I've been laying low for a long time since I ran mm -hmm. for mayor. I've been over laying low. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people have been asking how come I haven't been out there. It's because sometimes when you're a leader, you need to step back. That's right. 
and, 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 and analyze and That's look right. and see who's on first, who's on second, who's on third. That's right. Go and talk to you know our elders to, to get to get you know to, to, to get wisdom yes. you know, on how you move and how you maneuver. Mm -hmm. You know, because this enemy's here to kill us. Oh absolutely. <laughs> we ain't our friend. I know. I know. He's there to kill us. And so uh, uh, I want to make sure that this institution here has all the resources that it needs beautiful, beautiful. for our people yes. and for our children and our babies. You know, yes. A protection yes. Yes. for our community, you know. And there's nothing, and James Brown said it, said it. I'm black and I'm proud. That's right. Say it loud. Yes, sir. He didn't say say it low. He just said say it loud. <laughs> That's you right. Know and you know, I want to say this, is that um, this is a revolutionary yes, sir. experience right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. At a and &E. yes. This is a revolutionary experience. Yes, sir. It's, it's beyond, no, nobody in Fresno, uh, Central California. Yes, sir. I don't even think in the Bay Area. Yes, sir. I don't even think in L.A. Yes, sir. It's going, rolling like you are. Yes, sir. You know, and brother, I just have, uh, I just have just a joy coming here, and I'm being with you, with being with the family. And I think our, our our leadership team here, they they do a lot of work. Oh, they, I know. They, and, and they do sometimes wear two and three, four jackets. You know. Mm -hmm. uh, and how many? If they doing three and four, you doing two hundred. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to make sure that they know that I care for them. I mm -hmm. love them. I'll go the extra mile for mm -hmm. them. And that you know they have to have skin in the game too. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, the old saying you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make them drink it. Mm -hmm. We just want to make sure we respect them. That's we right. want to make sure that we treat it with dignity and respect. That's right, absolutely, and, brother. You know, and I did want to make this comment uh, since we're talking about dignity and respect. Yes, sir. Uh, as we well know, um, we have our sister running for president, and um, the stuff I heard to come out of uh, Republicans and other other folks, not just them, uh, degrading and debasing her because see, you and I know that we had 400 years mm -hmm. of uh, our women right. being debased, abused. You say anything you want to about them, to them, and I'm saying this as a brother, as, a, as an African-American, uh, we will not accept any degradation of that system. I don't care whether she's running for president or even if she's a prostitute on the street. Yes, sir. We're going to give her the honor that every black woman deserves. Yes, sir. Respect. Respect. We, and if we're in a group and somebody caught crazy, we've got to challenge that, like yes, all other men would do. Yes, sir. You don't see, no, you, you see that, you see that, you see what Trump, he doesn't say, you, you, all the people you hear him talk about, you don't hear him talk about them white women or Asian women and all of that. Because, see, he's still in the mindset yes, sir. that my ancestors survived through, that Jim Crow mindset. Yes, sir. That, that black people don't matter. We can say whatever we want. There's yes, no sir. consequences. Yes, sir. In our presence, there would be a consequence if you disrespect. Even though I know she's running for president. I don't care whether you vote for or not. Yes, sir. I want you to vote for her. Yes, sir. But certainly... I don't want her disrespect. Yes, sir. I want her to be treated just like you treat your wife and and the, and the Mexican ladies and everybody else. Yes, sir. I want that sister. Yes, sir. To be and as we as men must reinforce that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We can't be up. Ah, I don't like that. No, yes, no, that's a black woman. Yes, sir. You know, I'm still angry because brothers didn't get upset when Trump called uh, Am Amarosa a dog. The yes. brothers didn't get upset. Mm. I, I was I was so angry. I was angry with the the men, and they are lap licking him. I'm saying, brother, after she done, after he done called her a dog, right? And, and you 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 saying to me you ain't a man because you don't stand up for your own. And if and if we could put it on the terms, we know that a dog. I speak. Yeah, wonderful I, I, I speak <laughs> freely here because it's my TV radio show. Mm -hmm. Is that? And, and the and the Webster dictionary. Yes, sir. It says that a, a dog. And I apologize for those who may get offended. What I'm about to say, but words are powerful. Absolutely. When you call a sister a dog, is that what he called a dog? Yes. A dog. And, and the dictionary. And he didn't say other things. The New York Times has brought that out. 
Right. When you say dog, you're saying bitch. Yeah. B-I-T. Well, he didn't come out and say it that night. Right. And so, you know, it, it, it just, that is unacceptable. Yeah, We're it, not going to accept it. It just that. comes a time where men got to be men. Men, I totally or, or, agree. Or you're going to be a punk. It's yeah, one of the absolutely. Two. A for it's the day, for It's one of the two. A for and, the day. And, and we cannot allow people to So if it's going out all over the country, yeah. I want to make it crystal clear. Yeah. As black men, we will never accept debasing our women. Yeah. Under no circumstances. Has to be I don't care whether she's president. She could even be a Republican. I don't care. But she's yeah. a black woman. Right. She's going to get that respect because she's my mama. Right. And yours. Right. The mothers yeah. are mothers. Mother the mothers are mothers. mothers. And the queen of queens. Queen of queens. <laughs> mothers are mothers and queens are queens. So, there you have it, y'all. We, yes, we, sir. We're going to get ready for our morning service. And, 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 and you know, when, when our elders speak, I'm like, you know, I have an imaginary popcorn bag in my hand <laughs> on the edge of my seat, listening. You know how you go to, to, to the movie theaters, you buy some candy, some drink, you know. And that's how we are here when he comes, because we, we want to make sure we absorb Thank you, brother. all that he has. Matter of fact, we're going to be intentional and be selfish. We want all of it. <laughs> all of it. Yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes, sir. And Thank again, you. yes, sir. You have any last comments for us? Well, let's get that sister elect, number one. <laughs> and the other thing is that uh, it's just a great honor being here with you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. I, 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 words can't explain it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I just want to say that, brother. I'm just so honored to see yes, you. I, I, remember, I remember over 30 years ago, <laughs> you told me, you said, you know, Harris, we have to organize That's block right. by block by block. And you said, and it, and it don't matter if you have a grant or no. That's right. You said, we have to organize block by block. And then, yeah. and then I have, we have to understand that all of our people are not going to be receptive. Uh, that, which is true. You know, that's the reality. They're not mm -hmm. going to be receptive mm -hmm. to true uh, liberation mm -hmm. because we've been brainwashed. That's right. There's a lot of folks in this region here, oh, Fresno. Some real monsters. <laughs> embarrassed to be black. I agree. And, and it's the most craziest thing. And black is beautiful. That's right. Absolutely. And they all say, always been on black. <laughs> oh, uh, it, I love it. <laughs> we got to go get ready. So y'all two right, ready to We're going to bet on black. Uh, you right. can't go wrong. <laughs> all right. Thank all you. right, brother.